Okay, dear friends, if you all are able to find your seats, I think we can uh, start. So, uh, welcome and good morning. Good morning to all of you. Um, and welcome to this uh, meeting of the North Atlantic Council. Russia's war against Ukraine grinds on. Uh, President Putin is not preparing for peace. He is preparing for more uh, war. As we discussed yesterday with Minister Koleba, NATO allies are united in our commitment to sustain and step up our support. We must give Ukraine what it needs uh, on the battlefield to prevail as a sovereign and independent uh, nation. NATO will also continue to support other partners that face pressure from Russia, including Moldova, Georgia, and Bosnia and Herzegovina. We will discuss how to counter other threats and challenges facing our lines, including those uh, uh, emanating from the south, and how to deal uh, with the growing strategic competition, including China's increasing alignment with Russia. Finally, we will discuss defense spending in a contested and dangerous world. We cannot take our security for granted, so we must invest more in our defense. At the Vilnius summit, I expect our allies to agree an ambitious new defense investment pledge with 2% of GDP as a minimum to be invested in defense. I thank the media for joining us at the top of the meeting, and we continue in just a moment. Thank you so much. <clears throat>